early in the morning as Jesus and his companions came to shore. After an eventful night on the water, when Jesus had calmed the waves, they were met by a scary sight. Two men with parts of chains hanging off their arms, wild eyes, torn flesh and matted hair came running towards them. The disciples, scared by this display of demonic power, soon fled. But they noticed when they turned around that Jesus hadn't moved and he was right where they had left him. He who had created the worlds was not scared of these demons. Using the men as a medium, the demon spoke to Jesus saying, What have I to do with you, Jesus, son of the most high God? I implore you by God that you do not torment me. Jesus then said, Get out of the man, unclean spirit, and asked him what his name was. He said, My name is Legion, for we are many. The Bible account then says they begged earnestly not to be cast out of the country. There was a herd of 2,000 swine, pigs on the hillside, and they asked to be cast into them, a request that Jesus granted, and panic seized the herd, and they rushed madly over the cliffs into the lake below. A change came over these men. They were now in their right minds, and when the people came to see them, they found them clothed and sitting at the feet of Jesus. These men were known to the local people, and they had terrorized the area, but they were more upset about the lost pigs than they were happy they had been free. Fearing a further loss to the local economy, they urged Jesus to leave, and where he wasn't welcome, he left. As Jesus got ready to leave in a boat, the men who had been demon-possessed also wished to go. They felt a sense of safety with Jesus and longed to know more, but he forbid them to follow him. He told them they had a work to do, that they needed to go and witness to their friends and family and tell them what Jesus had done for them. These men had no formal training and they had not been mentored by Jesus one-on-one, -on -one, but they did have an experience, a real and a personal experience with Jesus. These men were the first missionaries into the area of Decapolis. The Decapolis was the region of 10 cities and these men traveled throughout proclaiming the good news. This city here of Jerash is one of those cities and no doubt these men came through here. Even though they had not heard a sermon from Jesus, or received one-to-one -one training with Jesus, they shared what they had experienced. Though the people rejected Jesus, he did not leave them without witness. And these men proclaimed the good news and converted many, so that when Jesus came back, there were thousands to meet him. Today, God is looking for people who will serve him. As soon as one gives their life to Jesus, there is born in them a missionary spirit. These men wanted to travel away and be with Jesus, but he sent them back to their families and hometown. These are sometimes some of the hardest people to reach, and maybe God is impressing you that you need to make a real effort to reach your friends and family. Ask God for an experience with him that you can share through word or action what you have seen, heard and felt with those you love.